What's the most favorite thing you had to give up because you grew too old for it? Trick or treating. Last time I went I was 15. I did dress up. But still the looks on people's faces when they opened the door told me it was time to stop. Playing on playground equipment. Why is this only for kids? Why are there not playgrounds for adults? And I don't mean gyms or places that you have to pay to get into. I mean adult-sized play structures that are free to use at public parks. Binge eating candy. It was fun as a kid. But buying my own to binge eat is kind of depressing. Also, if I kept doing it I would eventually develop serious health issues. A cardboard box I'd sit in and had drawn. In my mind. The controls of a rocket ship inside it. I'd sneak food from the kitchen to eat because I was sure I'd get hungry on my journey and being so far away. It wasn't an option to shout down to mum for food. I used to sit in it and my imagination did the rest oh if you could only see the places I've been. The journeys I've taken and the adventures I've had. 50 plus years old now and I still remember back to those places I've been and seen. Polly Pockets. I had a massive collection. When I was 12, mom said I was too old for dolls and made me give them to my niece. I didn't want to, but thought I'd get them back for my own kids one day. When my niece was told to pass them on to another one of my nieces. She did. But not before destroying the lot. I know they're just dolls. But I was devastated. Now I have a daughter who would have loved them. Not yet but soon I feel like I'll have to give up on Reddit. It feels like a lot of people here weren't even born when I created my account these days. Video games. I have less time each year. The games require more knowledge and input than they ever did. And a lot of games have so much bullshit attached that logging in and playing for 30 minutes you might have as a waste of time. I still play some. But it's getting less. But to be fair I am 50 this year. So maybe I am winning still. Running. One of my knees decided it was too old for it without consulting the rest of me. Unfortunately. Candy and soda. I still eat sugar. But at much lower doses and I'm way more picky with it. Candy and soda just makes me crash hard now. Swinging. I used to swing every day. I would listen to music and go out in the backyard and swing for hours just thinking and reflecting. And enjoying the repetitive motion. Water balloons. Water balloons were at the core of some of my favorite summer moments growing up. As I've transitioned from a summer camp counselor to mental health counselor though. Water balloons have lost a lot of their utility. Gaming. I'm getting bored with it. I bought Mass Effect 1 and 2 and didn't even start them. Roller coasters. I used to go with my dad and we would ride all of them at the park. Back to back. These days it just hurts my bones and gives me a headache that takes hours to get rid of. When I was a kid I swore I would never grow out of Peter Pan. I wasn't going to be a grown-up that forgot about Neverland or believed it was just a story. That would happen to other people but not to me. Now it's just nostalgia. Fair rides. I used to think they were fun. Last time I went on a fairly tame roller coaster. I felt so sick. I didn't do anything else for the rest of the time there. Being a kid. I mean an actual kid and not man-child. Playing with sticks killing imaginary skeletons and zombies like the badass I was. Eating whatever I wanted and never having to consider calories or fat grams I miss being able to. Eat anything I wanted and never gaining a pound. I took it for granted. Playing hide and seek. Even on bikes. Nobody wants to play in their 30s. As of right now. Video games.
not because I'm too old but I am getting older and I'm trying to get my life together the way I want it and I can no longer afford to spend the time playing games if I truly want to elevate my life. It's a sacrifice that I'm hoping will pay off in the future. I refuse to grow up and be boring. I get some strange looks when people see me running around with my arms stretched out making airplane noises. But fuck em. The freedom of children is still there if you drag it out from under all that responsibility and stress. Trust me. You gonna feel better if you pretend you're an airplane for two minutes. I promise. Dancing. Hip hop. But I'm not American it's much smaller here. Started at 18 was always the oldest or the odd one out cuz I started late and wasn't incredibly talented. Still enjoyed it but as health issues hit I couldn't keep up anymore. Rock concerts. I started having to deal with hearing damage in my mid-twenties. Honestly, school, I'm an only child and so not being alone was fantastic. I am not too old yet. But I love and respect skateboarding with all my heart and life. I may have to stop when I physically can't move anymore. <laughs> Candy and soda. It was cool when I was a kid. Then I started having dental problems and I had to cut down my intake. <laughs> Climbing trees. I'm finally tall enough to cover some ground. <laughs> FPS video games. I loved them when I was younger. Played Counter-Strike just after it released on Steam. Now they give me motion sickness. The Division is the only one I have played recently that I could play without getting a sick feeling. <laughs> Roller coasters. I can't ride them anymore. Because I have a bad back and last time I went to Bush Gardens I got whiplash from riding all of the coasters. Threw out my back at Disney when I rode, The Mummy Returns. Shame too. Coasters are one of the only things that make me feel truly alive. I miss not hearing myself stand up. All my joints pop. And I have no clue when I started doing the same dad grunt my father does. The joy of daydreaming about my future and where life would take me and the amazing things I could do. I remember being 16 and realizing that I didn't so much have a future anymore. Mostly just shit I had to do until I died. <laughs> Big wheels. Damn, I loved that thing. There's adult-sized ones, but they are really hard to find. <laughs> Tigger their tops are made of rubber their bottoms are made of springs so bouncy 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 fun. But the most wonderful thing about Tiggers is I'm the only one. The children's dentist they were so patient and just an amazing staff. But when I turned 18 they couldn't treat me anymore. I've struggled with going to the dentist ever since. Some cartoons I used to love as a kid I can't watch anymore. Thank goodness it's not all of them. Cow's milk. Realized I am not a calf or a baby anymore. Not a damn thing. Life's too short to stop doing something when you get older. Tony Hawk is what pushing 60 or 70 and still getting on a vert ramp. Keep your toys or whatever keep doing whatever makes this short time we have enjoyable. 1. Physical or overly silly comedy. I miss making silly jokes too. Goofing off without real world consequences. <laughs> Roller coasters and trampolines. They're fun at the time, but I feel it the day after. Just getting old. <laughs> Walking up and down the roads aimlessly all day long with my friends. <laughs> Hair ribbons. I think they're pretty, but after elementary school, they look weird. Unicorns. Stuffed animals. Figurines. The things little girls collect. Swinging on swing sets. Long. Full hair. My bobby car, literally couldn't fit in the seat anymore. I need a big swing in my yard. Or a big slide. I miss playing games in gym class.
Once in a while I'll look up cartoons I watched growing up in the late 90s, early 2000s. Like damn. I miss Dexter's laboratory. How did that even end? Well let me go see. And boy meets world. Roller coasters and climbing trees. Had to give up both as age 60 approached. Gaming not only do I have way less time nowadays. Even when I do it's like I can't put in the effort anymore to do something that active. There are so many games I have been planning on playing. But probably never will at this rate. As a kid it was things like Pokemon as an example that you had to act like you didn't like anymore. Once you hit a certain age. Now it's back in trend and we're adults so who cares? Like what you like. There's no such thing as too old. But there is such thing as too young. Having to take showers instead of baths calculating probable years left versus lifespan of pet. Sam's Club churros so sweet and sugary but also so sweet and sugary my body can't take it anymore. But I loved them.